hello everyone. Uh, this is Jennifer MS Park from SK Telecom in Korea. Uh, I'm going to talk about uh, how to secure our customers' safety against uh, AI-driven threats on cybersecurity as a telco operator. Now we are in an arms race situation with uh, uh, cybersecurity. Since the commercialization of LTE, cyber crimes attacks uh, based on SMS, LMS uh, have started to increase in South Korea. Initially, uh, as the technology to block messages based on customers' reports was introduced, uh, the number of crime decreased, but at the same time, uh, attackers' patterns evolved uh, uh, day by day. The number of uh, cyber crimes also continued to uh, decrease, uh, increase. In 2019, uh, the, after the launch of uh, messages uh, blocking service uh, for spam smishing and imper uh, impersonation uh, based on deep learning uh, technology, the number of crimes has been decreasing. Uh, there is uh, several up and downs uh, there. Um, however, uh, various new types of attacks uh, leveraging AI technology uh, continue to emerge. The attack and defense of cybercrime are becoming more sophisticated uh, and AI technology accelerating uh, this situation. In this session, uh, I'm sharing uh, the steps SK Telecom has taken uh, based on AI technology to secure our customers' uh, safety in so-called uh, cybersecurity arms race. The first direction of SKT is to uh, enhance uh, sensing uh, capabilities. Uh, attackers continuously attempt to exploit uh, weakness uh, in our network and service processes. No evolution of sensing uh, system, we fail to recognize new attacks. Uh, a characteristic of the cybersecurity field is that attackers' patterns are strengthening uh, day by day. Uh, so far, we have detected new uh, attacks by strengthening uh, our system log and database uh, monitoring from network and service um, perspective. However, there is a growing number of attack patterns that is not covered by uh, this monitoring uh, in OSS area we are developing. SKT has shifted uh, uh, its perspective. Uh, basic concept uh, is as follows. The, the actual damages and attacks occur from uh, our customers. So we have expanded from uh, monitoring uh, based on logs from network and, uh, and application uh, to analyzing as a base the customer behaviors to investigate new patterns of individuals, damages, or attacks. It includes analysis on uh, their uh, location, uh, mobility, uh, personal profile, and application and network usage. The second direction of SKT is to uh, develop advanced deep learning um, technologies on the customer's behavior data to detect all potential uh, cybercrime victims. A key feature of deep learning is uh, its ability to enable machines to uh, discover new patterns previously unknown uh, based on sophisticated sensing and labeled data. Uh, as mentioned earlier, 
uh, the attack patterns are becoming more and more sophisticated using AI technology, which find e effectively our weakness. We, the telecom operators, also need to develop uh, AI technologies eventually for detection of those uh, attacks. We need to datafy uh, system logs, customer level data, and uh, instance of attacks and damages. The machine, the machine should be uh, able to find the various attack patterns from uh, the above data, and we must continue to evolve uh, through these uh, processes. Next, we uh, would like to share uh, maze cases of SK Telecom. The first case of SKT uh, involves uh, uh, detecting potential cybercrime victims using uh, customer data and AI technology. From a data perspective, uh, we combine cybersecurity attack data, uh, such as spam and smishing, uh, with the victim location, mobility, personal profile, and network application usage data. We use the GeoBird uh, deep learning models for this purpose. We look at similar patterns of previous victims or attackers who show high network usage after staying at a certain location and accessing uh, unusual IPs, ports, etc. The second case involves uh, detecting uh, new attack patterns related to SIM security. Uh, SIM swap and copy uh, cases are newly emerging uh, threats in telecom sector. Uh, especially, uh, these cases are not only occurring, occurring domestically, but also internationally, uh, with the new patterns emerging uh, every day. We are specifying potential attackers uh, or uh, investigating victim patterns based on long-term customers' uh, behavior data. For example, uh, device change attempts, international travel history, and application access patterns uh, from previous attack or victim uh, cases. And we try to uh, reinforce the weak links swiftly via those uh, uh, models. Mm. In case of SIM swap, uh, it is necessary to collo uh, collaborate with the global uh, telco operators. Uh, thank you for your attention. Thank you. Mm. Mm.